Hi guys, this is Hai Kumar Kurtiwada. In this video, I am just summarizing all what we learned in React tutorials. So first thing I want to tell you is what are the different concepts we have covered here and what are the different types of hooks we have covered and what are things which we didn't cover. So let me go into the slides. So here the thing is I have covered all these things. So I have segregated into three parts. One is hooks, one is concepts and one is components. So coming to the hooks, we spoke about use ref, we spoke about use state, context, fx, use id, memos, callbacks, memo, that is react.memo for a functional component and we have created a custom hook and all we spoke about the red users. So all these hooks has been covered in this series and coming to the concepts, I have covered about the states, props, component communication, what is props drilling, what is lazy loading, what are the pure components and also we spoke about the component injection and coming to the components, we spoke about the functional components, lazy components, profiler components, strict mode components, provider component and also consumer components. All these components has been covered in this particular series but what didn't cover? So actually speaking, I didn't cover anything related to the class components. We spoke everything related to the functional components and why I I have preferred to create a functional component series is only one reason that is even Facebook is recommending us not to use that is the react team is not referring us not to use even even the react team is not recommending us to use the class components mainly from 18 version so if you are going to a documentation you can see we recommend defining the components as a function instead of classes so if you want to migrate you can use this migration page and you can migrate great from any of the class components to functional components so that is why I have not created anything related to the class components but coming to the functional component we have covered everything whatever we need in the real time and if you really want to cover this class components as well which are the reacts legacy APIs let me know in the comments I'll try to do a separate series for complete react tutorials only with the class components now we have covered all the functional components in the same way I'll try to cover all the components that is class components so mostly everything whatever related as per 18.13.1 we have covered in this video in this complete series hope this gives you a better understanding and you can learn most of them in the future for even by learning all these concepts you can just go to the interview for crack your react interviews and let me know what exactly you need further in the series like whether you want a new series on redux or redux tongue or any other react libraries whatever you are interested please let me know in the comments i'll just go through that and i'll try to create that particular series and also I have focused on many of the series in my channel. Just go through all the different types of series which I have started on web development that is related to Angular. You have around 130 videos where you can try to understand from basic that is beginner to advanced level of Angular till 18 and also I have created a new playlist which is related to HTML and CSS that is nothing but a web development and you can go through that web development as well to understand all the concepts related to HTML CSS and still I'm planning for JavaScript complete series end to end even that will be coming up onto my channel soon so please stay tuned and try to understand all these concepts and you will become a pro in your web development that's it for this series hope you all like my explanation and the concepts which I have cleared in this and hope you like my explanation if you like my video like share subscribe to my channel for more updates signing off thank you